Don't be too aggressive. Try not to lose the grip in the front. So you go soft on the accelerator to control this sliding. Also much about the Indian men. <laughs> they are very sensible, but here you're going to try to <laughs> learn it. Yeah? And patience. Yeah, very sensitive towards them. Yeah? <laughs> Hi, I'm Kushan Mitra and you can see a Audi RS4 Avant going on a frozen field. I'm here in Munio in northern Finland, really close to the Arctic Circle. It's minus 10 degrees right now and we are here for the Audi Ice Experience 2024, driving these super powerful cars on top of a frozen lake. Yes, right beneath me are, is water. The ice is super thick, so I'm not worried at all. It's cold, so there's no danger about anything. But this has been a tremendous experience of driving. I did this last year, if you recall, in Seefeld, Austria, but this is different. Over there, we were driving on iced, on an ice field. This is a proper frozen lake. This is a almost a six kilometer long track with slides and turns as you can see going 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 and let's see this going going very hard as indeed so this is a really great learning experience for me it really teaches you how to drive how to adjust the power get off the gas turn in the car drift a bit we're driving with electronic stability control off completely off and obviously with um, winter tires which give you extra grip but the ice isn't very grippy it's a huge driving challenge now, later in this video, I'll be talking to some of the other drivers as well as Barbir Dhilov from Audi India to see how you can come to Austria or Finland to do the ice drive or anywhere in Northern Europe for that matter. Can you do the ice drive? Is this going to be open to customers going forward? So let's get going. Let's see how the others do. And I have to get ready for my time lap as well around the circuit. So guys, we're waiting for our turn to start. Somebody has slid off, so um, no need to be brave. Good luck. It's a lot tougher than it looks and I'm definitely not the best driver here but that was fun I don't know what my time is let's find out what my time is so sir how bad was I? I don't know tell me your name first Kushan that's K-U-S-H-A-N Kushan Mitra yes Mitra 419 not bad I know I'm not the best driver the guys have done 404 I know 15 seconds <laughs> is a lot so as you can see, it's quite stressful doing an in-car piece to camera without making a mistake. But here's the thing, get it right and the smile on your face goes from year to year. You drift from corner to corner, getting it perfect, the snow just going up like big white rooster tails. You don't understand how happy getting it right makes you feel and getting the speed right getting everything right this is one of the most enjoyable driving experiences one can have so guys that was a lap around the circuit it's been great fun thank you so much and now let's do some more driving on ice let's do some drifting i mean a time lap is yeah it's fun but so i'm on a new track now at the audi ice experience and we've been told that the tractor that is supposed to haul us all out in case we mess up has an issue, which means I have to be extra super careful. It's been snowing and lots of people have been going out and which means that car number six also out here. So, oops, go 
slow, don't want to knock anybody out, I uh, don't want to damage the car also. See that wasn't good, I went to almost full 180, almost full steering block. Severe understeer, oversteer is good, understeer is bad on the track. Audi presense activated over there, and that meant and I've got full steering lock. Yep, 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 yep. Slide, buddy. Slide, baby, slide. <laughs> this is fun, man. This is so much fun. So yeah, will Audi bring this to India? Uh, the RS4 to India? Well, I think they should. Will they? That's a different thing altogether. Let's go past. It's another stranded car. Now last year I did this as well in Seefeld, Austria, but this is much more fun because this is a full track. It's flat, it's plain and it's amazing driving. It's really tough as well because you're constantly turning and you're adapting the steering and I'm really grateful Audi has brought me here and paired me up with a great guy, Aspi Bhatena, the editor of Car India magazine, who's been teaching me a lot. I mean, I don't think Aspi wanted to teach me as much as he's had to, but so far, I don't have a single punch on my card. You see, every time you get dragged out of the snow, you're supposed to get a punch on your card. I came here in 2015 and I had a lot of punches on my card. So yes, I'm a slightly better driver than I was back then. But driving on ice is not easy. It's very counterintuitive. You have to adjust your grip because this is ice. Uh, it's not very grippy. Even though we're using winter tires, the cars are struggling for grip and you're driving with traction control, electronic stability control, off it's challenging and we've really learned how to drive um, there are 19 others of us here so we, everybody's getting their grips not everybody's a great driver nor am i for that matter because driving on ice is not something that comes naturally to folks from india but in finland it's quite amazing how well the people drive out here because some, the hardest driving test in the world is in Finland, whereas in India, you know how you can get a lot of driving license out here. No, you really know how need to know how to deal with ice and snow on the road. I've often said it's very easy to drive fast in a straight line or even drive fast around a circular track. It's not easy to drive fast on the ice, believe me, because it's so counterintuitive. Yes, you follow the same principles. You you know, slow down just before a corner, use the brakes, shift the weight balance so that, you know, the front tires grip harder and you should know when to counter steer. As you can see in the video, I'm always shifting my hands and that's because Audi's awesome trainers taught me what to do and when to do it. And I had a great group of people with me, some of India's most renowned auto journalists and auto influencers. This was an amazing experience. Yes, it was cold. It was minus 22 on one day, but this was amazing. And Audi India makes it open for all their customers as well. Very first batch of our customer this year is joining us tomorrow in Finland. So we have 20 customers who are joining us for this ICE experience. But apart from this, uh, obviously every year we also do the BIC, uh, the racetrack experience. Uh, but uh, apart from this, we also have luxury experience with our customers, which are also being done by our dealerships, where we take customers across the country on various drives. Uh, and we have an overnight stay, some special program for food. You know, basically the idea is that we connect very, very closely with the customers and customers connect with each other. So we just like we believe in an Audi family and that's what we do. And when Continuously, we also have Quattro Drive where uh, customers can have on uh, our uh, key, key range of cars on-road, off-road experience. So throughout the year, these programs keep on running and that's how we interact with our customers. Yes, it's called make sure you carry your warm clothes with you. And the experience got better as well. We didn't just drive on the ice. We also took some snow scooters on the ice as well. This was an amazing experience and one that I will never ever forget.